And we begin tonight with breaking news, a deadly shooting on the city's far east side. As you can imagine this evening, emotions are running very high there at the scene. This is all taking place outside of an apartment complex near 30th Street and Midhoffer Road. Eyewitness News reporter Emily Longnecker is there right now after speaking with investigators on the scene. Emily, what's the latest? Well, Andrea and John, this is still a very busy scene here tonight, very active at the Bavarian Village Apartments with Crime Lab just arriving. You can see a lot of people in the background. There's a lot of grief here tonight, a lot of crying. Those are family members of the victim. When police got here just about an hour ago, they found a man shot to death in the back seat of a car. A large police presence has been here ever since as they try Try and figure out who may be witnesses and who are grief stricken family members, and then ultimately what happened here tonight. They've got several areas inside taped off as they try and figure out where exactly this shooting happened. We do believe that the shooting occurred outside of the vehicle at a secondary location, and then the subject was put, it ran to the vehicle. So, like I said, it's a complicated scene, preliminary information, but we do have one deceased victim, adult male. Um, suffering from gunshot wounds. And we know from police that several chaplains are here on scene trying to comfort people. You can see a lot of people are gathered. Some of them are family members. We've heard many of them um, crying out in grief, um, saying that they were related to this victim. At this point, investigators again have a lot of areas taped off here in Bavarian Village Apartments. They're not exactly sure where this shooting happened, but they believe that wherever the victim was shot, he then ran to the back of the car. They think perhaps someone was uh, going to drive him somewhere, perhaps for some help, but again, that never happened. John